I think I'll be audible enough to reach you all. If not, then you can tell me, you know, you can use this. Uh, well, good afternoon, everybody. Good afternoon, sir. Uh, thanks to Dr. Das Gupta for giving me the opportunity to come over here and, uh, you know, and spend some time with you all. And I'm sure it has to be a dialogue, not a monologue. Let me share my experience. You know, uh, some good words, uh, you know, told about me. I don't know whether at all uh, it's befitting for me or not. Well, yes, uh, you know, it has been a long journey for me, uh, having spent uh, initial years in uh, Canada Bank, then moving to Standard Chartered in different roles. I have seen banking really, you know, passing through different phases. And what today banking is, is not what, you know, it was there in the last 25 to 30 years. What I really thought to really cover today or share is my experience. There is no point of having a verbal diarrhea as to talk about the ratios and all which may not entice you people. So before I really take off, I would rather, uh, you know, a simple question, how many of you all actually have interest to join a bank? Generally, I do not know. The, the hardcore people who are in finance will definitely really want to really get into those units which involves, you know, uh, you know, uh, what should I say, uh, number crunching or an analytical perception. That is one really, you know, part to really take it forward. The others who are marketing oriented, possibly they would really would like to uh, get into roles which involves. Uh, you know, the selling of other uh, products with the plain vanilla products which the bankers have. The two different things. So again over there, how many of you would be interested to get into those, you know, core areas of, uh, you know, uh, uh, financial analysis? Good. Okay. Good. I'm sure at the end of the second year, you all must be having some idea about financial analysis, right? To start with, can anybody give me a, you know, uh, uh, a differentiation between leverage and gearing? Anybody? It's very simple, very simple. Sorry, uh, yeah. leveraging, uh, leveraging over low when you are trying to expand uh, and it's not leveraging, uh, you are actually 